website. Maybe you are thinking about having your first one made, or maybe you just need a better, improved website. In any case, you should know at least some of the basics about web design, and no worries, you would only need three minutes. A website is a core of your online marketing activities. If you look at all the marketing channels and techniques, what they actually do is to bring visitors to your website, and the main purpose of the website is turning these visitors into customers. In marketing terms, this is called conversion. A bad website will basically cost you more money because you can't convert them into customers, because you don't need more visitors if you can't turn them into customers. So the better the website is, the more visitors are converted into customers. And it really does not matter whether you sell consumer products online, provide local services, or build houses. Many people in the industry call themselves web designers, but they are really just a bunch of geeks with basic coding knowledge. Of course, without much planning, they will pretty quickly create a website for you with lots of information, photos, contact information. But the question is, is that the way to turn your visitors into your customers? Is that what you need? And the answer is no. What you have to do is look for someone serious about web design. Well, that's where we come in. This is how we make a website by following this seven phase web design process. Phase one, analysis. The first step is always about information gathering, identifying things like website purpose, website goals, and the target audience. Phase two, planning. The planning includes the definition of the site map, website structure, and the technologies used that we are about to use. Phase three, design not only to be focused on wireframes and visual styling the stage, but also on the usability of the user interface and the best possible user experience. Phase four, content. Content is the very important part of the process. Choosing the right text, copyright, photos or videos, all of it optimized not only for your visitors, but for the search engine optimization, SEO. Phase five, here, we actually create the website using hypertext markup language and cascading style sheet, HTML and CSS coding, with some help of databases and other technologies as well. If needed, our websites can be made accessible to mobile devices, responsive design. Phase six, testing. We test all the technical features like code and scripts, technical testing, with compatibility with major browsers, browser compatibility, and we also ask ourselves if the website really fulfills its purpose. Phase seven, deployment. After we launch the site, our job is definitely not done yet. We always monitor what's happening after the start, enabling us to fix any possible deficiencies, bug fixing. And if you want, we can also manage the future maintenance and update for you. As you can see, that web design is a very complex process and we believe this is how websites should be done and our customers agree. And if you share our passion for high quality websites, let's get in touch. We will be happy to help you with what we do best.